Welcome to Nine Finger Mining. I'm Creature Host, and today we are going to have some fun getting down and dirty in some good old, well, Alaskan dirt. What the hell? I live in Alaska. Let's play some Alaskan dirt, right? Like I don't play enough of it. But today we are going to go through Thomas 907's pay dirt. So there's a gram of guarantee gold in here. So let me get y'all clean set up over at the cleanup sluice over there, and let's get down and dirty with some Thomas 907 dirt, huh? Sound good, Kiki? I want to thank everybody for watching. Um, hopefully by the end of this, I'll earn a subscription, a like, leave a comment. And hey, you could share the video with other people. You know, it's okay. I, I won't be mad, you know. And let's see what else. Uh, if you'd like to be a Patreon, um, I'll leave a link down in my description. I'll be doing a Patreon video, a reward video here real quick. Um, we give away all kinds of cool stuff every month. Um, probably going to give away a t-shirt this time with a bunch of other stuff. So... As we're sitting here watching LD's Outdoors and Adventures, he's going to go through all his old pay dirt bags, and it's crazy how much gold is actually left in these if you don't wash these out. So, if you don't know who LD's Outdoors and Adventure is, go check him out. He's out of Canada somewhere. I don't know exactly where in the Canadian area. Um, but yeah, he's a pretty cool dude, so swim over to his channel, LD's Outdoor and Adventures. Check him out. So, let me get you set up over here. First, let me shut up. Oh, two things. Uh, before I say that, let me shut up. We got a new material in for shirts. We got a prism. Woo! Right, Kiki? We got that for our shirts. For designs on shirts, whatever designs. And then we got fluorescent blue. We'll be getting more colors and more colors and more colors. So, if you want something cool, just let me know. We're into making some shirts. Um... Possibly some small flags. We're working on that, learning how to do those right now. It's not as easy as it sounds. We'll just put the shit on there and do it. <laughs> yeah, you just think that. Go ahead and buy all the shit and try it, and you'll just see how easy it is. And watch all those YouTubes. They're, they make it super quick and easy, too. Like, oh, it always works every time. I can show you the garbage can. It fails. So, on another note, let's get set up over here, and let's get dirty. Be right back. All right, we're over here at the table. I got us a, uh, there's a freaking bug in my house. What the hell? Middle of winter, I'm gonna have to eat it. Um, we're all set up here at the table. I got a quarter inch classifier. I got some pans here. We're just gonna pan out all the nasty big organics and the quarter inch material into one pan and then pan that out and then we'll run the smaller uh, material through the VDR cleanup sluice, baby. We haven't used our Devon Gold VDR cleanup sluice in quite a while, so I figured we'd break that bad chicken out and get her dirty. Yeah, you know I mean, you can't let your shit, excuse me, you can't let your stuff sit forever, right? It, you know, it just collects dust. So, let's have some fun. Pull our sleeves up and get down and dirty. And some good old Thomas 907 Pater. We did a trade, so he got some of my material. What the hell is that a rip here? I did rip up here. This is like an adult proof bag, right? There we go. Oh, yeah, this is Alaska dirt. There's more mica and crap in here. Yeah, typical. <laughs> Figured I'd try out a different Alaska pay dirt, you know, since he's down south from me. A little way, so. Oh, I see a big chunk of gold right there. Nice. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Tell me if you can see it. Oh. And for all you who guessed on where that gold pay dirt or that nugget I found in the tailings tub come from, for all of you that guessed Benzo Gold, you're correct. That was the Benzo chunk I lost. So we found it. Benzo has been found. I repeat, Benzo has been found. Are we losing more shit again? Maybe the bug committed suicide and jumped in the water. I don't know. I see gold right here. Gold right there. There's some nice gold in here, Thomas. And I haven't even gone through it yet. I hope you're having fun with that kinky pay dirt. <laughs> uh, I love it when people buy that shit. Okay, let me throw this over there. We're done with that. So let me get all this cleaned up and we will be right back to getting wet now. 
Who wants to get wet with me? <laughs> okay, that sounded wrong. So who wants to wash these rocks with me in the water? We'll get this all wet. We'll rinse it in, see this out. Well, we gotta put it in here anyways, because we don't want our pay dirt dry when we run it through the sluice. You don't want dry material, so. All right, everybody, we are back here down at the tub here. We got our tailings tub right down there. Let me scoot right over here. Let me get this camera zoomed in a little bit better. Let me not yell in your ear. Sorry about that. There, because you don't need to see me. You already know how cute I am. Bingo. Bada bing, bada bang. I saw another one in there too. Ooh, ooh. I think those are schist or something, or mica or something. We shall see. So it looks like we got three big chunks so far. So let me get those in the snuffer dover bottle. I don't think those are gonna suck up the snuffer, so. I have a feeling we lost a piece in there somewhere. I'm not I'm not absolutely sure why I feel that way. But I do. I may be wrong. There it is. There it is! Right there, baby. I knew we lost a piece somewhere. I had that stinking suspicion. And if, that, if that's gold, which it looked like it was, it's heavy like it was, it's dirty gold. So, let's get on to the cleanup sluice and let's get a ripping. I'll be right back when we get it all fired up, tuned up, and ready to go. See you soon. All right, everybody. We are back at the awesome Gold Hog cleanup sluice with our Badass Devin Gold VD Heart Cleanup Sluice sitting inside of it, incognito. <laughs> As we got our stuff all sitting here, it's all soaked, soaked in the water. Let's start revving it through the VDR sluice. See what kind of beautiful gold we get. <laughs> There's gold already. Look at that chunky sitting right there. You gotta check that out. Y'all gotta see it. Look at it. Look, 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 look. Look at that badass. Oh, you can't see the lights. I'm glaring it. There we go. Yeah. That's badass Thomas 907 gold right there, baby. If you don't know him, go check him out. Or our sandbox, it's actual. This is real dirt. I can tell. It's Alaska dirt. Uh, just a little bit, clean these ripples out. Just a little bit more. There's been a lot of lights sitting in there dancing. Uh oh. You know what that means, folks? Means we're cavitating our pump. So we're gonna take a little intermission, get yourself a beer, get yourself a safety meeting. But hurry the hell up and get back to your seat so we can get going on this. I gotta grab some more water. I'll be right back. Okay, we are back. Pump's not going Rah! cavitating for air anymore, water anymore, so I think we're good to go now. So let's keep up. Shoveling the gold in here. Yep. All that sparkly in this dirt and none of it's worth a sparkly poo. Typical Alaska dirt. Fun part's gonna be the very end of so much black sands and then I see quite a bit in the, in here. I see some right there in the ripples. I see some of them ripples there. So, we'll see. Been shoveling snow all day. Same with yesterday. Same with tomorrow. Guess what? I'll probably be doing the next day too. Yay! <laughs> I got like weeks of snow shoveling to do. Whoa, Ab Ricky, is it raining? It's raining! <laughs> no, I guess they don't think that's funny. That's a beautiful sight. When you see this thing, it's load. Can you say loaded? Loaded. Here, come look at it. Shit. 
You ain't gonna listen to me talk about it. I'll just show you. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Loaded, baby. Like a big ass baked tater. Loaded. Tater always says loaded. Mm mm mm. This is beautiful, isn't it? Okay, well, I'm gonna get this all shut down, dumped in the tub, and thrown in the pan. And as soon as I get in the pan, I will be right back and we can look at all this beautiful gold as I pan it out. And we will dry it up, weigh it out, and hopefully we got our gram. If not, we screwed up. It's in the tub, so we'll have to search for it because I know John or, or Thomas at Thomas907 doesn't rip people off. He's got honest bags, so he guarantees them. He's another seller that guarantees his weight, so. All right, everybody, we are back over here. Where's my snuffer? There's my snuffer bottle. Gonna need that for the other chunky, uh, chunky nuggets of gold. We'll put that right up in there, right up in there. So, as you can see, there's already gold all over in that bad boy. Shining bright like, like Las Vegas on a Sunday night. Saturday night, Friday night. No, I don't know. I guess Vegas never sleeps, so it doesn't matter what night, right? <laughs> you tell I don't go out and do that kind of shit. I don't go out to Vegas or nothing. I've been there. Boring. I'd rather go out in the dirt somewhere and play. So let's get this all panned out here. And we will see what we've got. Some pretty gold, Thomas. Oh, in case y'all didn't know, you know where this is going, right? In the 1,000 sub container. That'll be another gram of gold in that bad chicken. Somebody's going to win a nice big amount of gold. That's for sure. So let's tap this back and let's see what kind of yum yums we got in here. Don't you think you're tapped going anywhere? Oh, excuse me. Come to daddy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at all that shiny, baby. Daddy needs new shoes. Oh wait, that's right, this is going to the sub container. Somebody needs some new shoes. <laughs> got that beautiful gold getting sucked up in there. I hope you're getting to see it all go up in the tube. Just, just sucking it all up. Oh, there's a chunker still sitting in there. Mayday. There's another little one. Ooh, I saw a little piece. Couple little pieces. All right, let's do a snuffer duffer dump. I need to name my snuffer bottle. What's a good name for it? And it can't be nothing disgusting. Come on, there's there's women and children and all kinds of stuff. Elderly people that watch this channel. So it can't be disgusting, but what kind of name, what, what name can we give it? So we can put a sticker on it and name it, you know, because it's just a snuffer bottle. Like, everybody's got a snuffer bottle. Hooby doo You know. Well, I'm going to leave what little bit of sand, black sand there is in there. I guarantee you there's a gram of gold, no matter what. So, that's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So, I'm going to suck that up. I'm going to get that in a pan. I'm going to go dry it out, and I will meet y'all back at the table. So, intermission number two. Hurry up. Be back at the table in a minute. 
All right, everybody. Well, we are back down here, and of course, the annoying heater decides it's gonna come on, so let's get this on here. Let's get this scale cleared. Let's get this weight up. Now, we know it's gonna be a gram. I guarantee you there's more than a gram in here. I can tell just by looking at the chunky pieces. I mean, there are quite a few pickers in here. I mean, quite a few. Another one over here. Another one here. I mean, there's like five, five or six pickers in here. You know, I mean, there's some nice ones. I gotta say, Thomas, nice gold, man. I, I, I liked it. I liked the bag. It was fun to go through. Let's see. Oh yeah, way over. Granted, there's some black sands and crap in there because, well, I kind of got a little lazy because it's going in this. I mean, I'm not going to give somebody just raw, beautiful gold. You're going to work in it a little bit too, but damn, you know how much gold you're getting? Three point four grams right there. Okay, so we'll say three point three and three point two five because there's some crap in there. And then you got two pater bags, all for just being a subscriber. All you gotta do is hit that sub button. This could all be yours. Once again, thank you for watching. I'm be reminding. I hope you enjoyed the show. Um, yeah, it's still super cold, but all I'm doing is shovel, shovel, shovel. So. As soon as I can get back out and have some fun in the water, I will be. But until then, we're just going to keep playing and finding other new cool things to do. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to get to making a few different shirts and mess around with this stuff and see how well I like it. See what I can do. Maybe make a flag out of it or something. Uh, I don't know. I can make me look better. Here, make a mask. So, thanks for watching. Be safe. Have fun. And I will see you on the next one. Bye. I never